guys it's Dante and today we are back with another squad builder now this one's going to be a little bit unconventional to what I usually do on the channel it's going to be a hybrid it's going to be players that I've used a lot more than some of the other players in the squad it's literally just my team it's my current team which I'm actually changing players out trying new players um, so all of them are going to have different games I just wanted to bring you the squad guys because this is by far the best team I have used on FIFA 18 and I just wanted to share it with everyone so Getting straight into it, guys. In goal, we have gone with 84 rated Berkey. Now, this guy is absolutely amazing. By far the best goalkeeper I have used. As you can see, I've used him for 32 games, which is probably the longest I've ever kept a goalkeeper for because I think they're all crap. Plus, 84 rated for 2,700 coins. Even if you don't use him, you don't like him, just keep him because he will definitely do well in a squad builder challenge in the future for an 84 rated player. So, moving on to the um, his the first centre back, which is a player from the same team, and that is Top Rack. We need the perfect link there for the chemistry guys, because the hybrid is a bit crazy in terms of links. Uh, but Top Rack, he he just I just don't understand, or I just can't think of how this guy performs as well as he does in games. Like honestly, he is literally he's so much better than Boateng in my eyes. He's better than Hummels. He's better than every other centre back in the Bundesliga maybe even on the game guys he is just so amazing and overpowered 76 pace 85 defense and 75 physical he's literally just the perfect defender six foot one as well and he only cost 4100 coins now moving on to the next center back position we have gone with a player from the premier league and he's actually untradeable um we packed him in the untradeable scream pack which is i, I actually was pretty happy with it only because he was in the Premier League and I always usually have a Premier League team for my main squad. So I was really happy with that. Um, his stats are amazing. 81 defense, 86 physical. And by the time you guys are seeing this squad builder, he will either be going into his 80... I think it's an 88 rated um, card. Either just as you're seeing this or just after you're seeing this guy. So literally, he is going to be amazing. He's already got 86 physical, 81 defense, 64 pace, which isn't the best, but... Um, during the 29th to the 31st, his pace is going to be boosted, which is going to be absolutely amazing. Now, moving on to the right-back position, we have gone with one of the best right-backs in the game, and that is Valencia. Valencia is just indescribable. He, he feels like he's got 97 pace, not 87. His dribbling is amazing, his passing is amazing, and he's so strong. Stick a shadow card on him, and he is even better. Um, as you can see, two goals and five assists in 49 games, which isn't too bad for a right-back. He costs about 30,000 coins at the time of recording this video. So um, if you guys did want to go out and pick him up, definitely do so. He is one of the best, well, fullbacks in the game. Now moving on to the left-back position, we have gone with another player from the Bundesliga. He's a little bit lower rated, but he is definitely up there in terms of skill level, and that is Wendell. 5 foot 9. 1,300 coins, 86 pace, 77 dribbling, 71 defense, 72 physical, and 72 passing. The only reason I got him is because, again, he is a perfect link into our left center midfielder just to get the extra chemistry that we need for the squad. Um, but that was the decision I made based on chemistry, but I'm so glad I put him into the team because he is one of the best left backs I've used this game. He just always seems to be in the right position. He's really strong, he's quick, and he can catch up to players no matter who they are. He's caught up to so many players, especially during foot champs, guys. So he is definitely, definitely the best choice fullback for this squad. Now moving on to the first centre mid position, we have gone with another player from the Bundesliga, and that is Sven. No, it's not Sven. Is it Sven? It is. It's Sven Bender, guys. I always get mixed up which, um, which one is which in terms of the Bender brothers, but... Sven Bender, you can go with Lars Bender. I just used him because I got him in an untradeable pack. Um, but you can use Lars. He's got a little bit... I think his shot's better and maybe his dribbling's better. But in terms of defence and pace, they are pretty similar or the same. Um, Bender is amazing. He is literally the defensive midfielder that you need in your squad. 32 games, 4 goals, 2 assists with high defensive work rate. 6 foot 1, 83 defence, 8 physical and 71 pace. You cannot go wrong with this card. Now moving on to the next midfielder position, we have gone with another player from the Prem, and that is Emre, Ka Emre Chan. He is amazing. Um, I initially went with Gundogan, but I really wanted the, def the defence and the physical that Emre Chan could offer the team, and he is amazing. 71 pace, 77 dribbling, 67 shots, 78 defence, 76 passing, 84 physical. 
Um, however, if you look at his shooting stats, his, his long shots are 72. So if you are going to shoot with his card, definitely take long shots. They're not amazing, but when you hit them right, they do fly in. And that is what I love about this card. Four-star weak foot as well, high, high work rates, five goals and five assists in 32 games. And he's, pre he's pretty much just 1,000 coins at the moment. So really, really cheap. Now, the next centre mid position, we originally had Delhi Ali, but he wasn't performing as well as we wanted him to for the squad. So what we did is we went out and just got Fernandinho. He's been in the club for a while, but we stuck him in there. And um, I'm going to explain to you fully why we just stuck him, a random player there, in a minute. Um, but as you can see, guys, two goals, eight assists, 57 games. Um, the stats aren't amazing in terms of um, how many goals and assists he's got in the amount of games he's played, but you'll know why in a minute, guys. Um, 73 pace, 77 dribbling, 73 shots, 77 defense, 6, 76 passing and 78 physical as well. High defensive work rate. So he is still a really good CDM. He sells for about 2,000 coins now. So he has dropped a lot in price. So definitely pick him up if you want him in your squad. Now moving on to the right or left wing position actually. We are going to go with a player who we absolutely love this year. I used him before in a squad builder. Didn't really like him that much. But this time round he is amazing. 32 games played, 23 goals, 18 assists. He does set you back about 110,000 coins at the time of recording this video. So um, if you do not have the coins, definitely pick up a cheaper left wing from the Bundesliga. Possibly Schürrle. There are quite a few decent players that you can go and pick up. Even Ribéry is quite cheap. So if you can't afford Royce, definitely go out and pick up another Bundesliga left wing. Um, but Royce, 87 shot, 88 passing, 85 dribbling. Four-star weak foot as well. He is just amazing. Um, 84 passing, which is pretty good for a winger as well, which is absolutely just perfect for when he cuts in because I love cutting in with players like Marco Royce. He's small, he's agile, he's got good dribbling. So when you do cut in, you can easily pick out the overlapping pass and it's basically just a guaranteed goal when this guy cuts in. So moving on to the right wing position, we have gone with another player from a previous squad and that is Mkhitaryan. Now, we love Mkhitaryan. I don't think I can use another right wing from the Prem because this guy, just he's just so much better than them all. Um, 86 pace, 86 dribbling, 79 shot, 80 passing and 70 physical. High, high work rates, 5 star weak foot and 4 star skills. Um, he costs about 22,000 coins at the time of recording this video, so has dropped as well from last week when you would have seen another squad builder featuring him. Um, he's got 19 goals and 16 assists in 32 games, which is really good for a right, a right wing. Now, moving on to the striker position is a player you have already seen. Um, we absolutely love him. I love him even more than when I first got him, and I loved him so much then, and that is player of the month, Harry Kane. As you can see, guys, 106 games, 104 goals, and 58 assists. He literally, he, oh my, he just doesn't miss. There's no words to describe how many shots I've taken with this guy and how many Shot, how many goals I've scored from those shots. It's just ridiculous. The 92 shot, 76 pace is a little bit slow, but stick a cat catalyst card or a hunter card or a shadow card, whatever card that boosts pace, stick it on him and he will get so much faster. He's really strong as well, so he's really good at holding up the ball for those overlapping players. And he's just overall just one of the best strikers I've used so far this year. Definitely, definitely. I know you guys can't pick up the SBC card, but definitely... Pick up his normal card if you can't afford this and just stick some boost cards on him, guys, because he is just amazing. Now, that is the squad. And the reason why I was contemplating on putting a random player here at right mid is because or right centre mid is because when the game starts, I automatically switch up the formation um, and I bring on Son. This is the formation I run it with, guys. I put Makatarian on the right centre attacking mid and I bring on Son and play him central attacking mid and then I keep those two in those positions. Guys, this is definitely the best formation I have used in a while. And sticking wingers in centre attack in mid is just amazing because you've got people with pace running through the centre of the centre of the pitch and they're all overlapping each other, which is absolutely amazing. So um hope you guys have enjoyed the squad builder. If you have, make sure to hit the like button down below. It really does help out a lot and it only takes a second. If you're new to the channel and you want to keep seeing squad builders just like this one, make sure you hit the subscription button as well. Hit the little notification bell so you know exactly when I have uploaded and you can be the first person to watch my videos. If you guys do have any suggestions on players that you would like to see in this squad or players that you would like to see in future squad builders, definitely write it down below in the comment section and I'll make sure to respond to those and also build those squads for you guys as well. Hope you guys have enjoyed. It's Dons and goodbye.